Hi everybody, welcome back. So this is going to be a little bit of a quick video. This is kind of, um, I have a lot of records that I need to get to move right now and sell. So I'm going to just showcase all of them. And if you're interested in any of them, please let me know. Um, you can either shoot me in the comments. You can get uh, just email me. It's just in the base clap at yahoo.com. I'll put that in the description. Um, or all these are on my Discogs page as well. So I'm going to go through all of the used ones first, and then all of the second batch are all still sealed and new and really heavy hitters. And and some of them are pretty hard to find now. So and as with any of these, like I said, you can look on Discogs. If you want to email me and just go direct through PayPal, I can give you discounts that way. Um, one of them pretty much is, is a really cheap record, so I'm kind of just going to utilize that as a giveaway um, if you buy kind of a, a value that's um, past a certain amount. So the first one that I'm going to show you, very rare record, very hard to find. Uh, sincerely Conti. This is a 10 inch that's on Bethlehem. This is in outstanding condition. You can go on my Discogs and look it out, but this is like strong VG plus all the way around. Really, really great shape, really hard record to find. Um, so that's the first one. The second one, like I said, is kind of going to be a giveaway. Now, if you're interested in it, obviously I'm not charging much for it. It's five bucks, but you know, you're going to spend that much to kind of ship that as well so kind of doesn't make a whole lot of sense honestly just to buy the one but obviously if you really really want to um but it's uh weather report 830 i happen to get a second copy of this um so like i said it's five bucks if you want it just this if not what i'm pretty much doing is if you buy any record that's like 50 bucks or more i'm just going to throw this in as, a, as an extra um with it so uh that's that one uh the next one is a pretty hard record to find this is bella fleck and the fleck tones jingle all the way this is actually their christmas album it's still sealed never been opened brand new uh it has some damage to the barcode looks like somebody tried to scratch it out so uh there's that but again you can find this on the discogs or just you know message me directly um, with that one. The next one actually um, I ended up upgrading my copy of this and so this one is like a third or fourth press. I think it's a fourth press but it's Thelonious Monk the Unique. Um, this one's a, um, a a Riverside Mono. Like I said I think it's like a third or fourth press um, you know on the blue reel to reel Riverside. It's in very nice shape um, so if you're interested in that one let me know um, but uh, Monk the Unique, Riverside 209, I actually um, just ended up uh, running into a earlier copy, so this one's now kind of, um, you know, moving along, so Monk the Unique. Uh, the next one is going to be um, a Bethlehem title, which is Charlie Mariano Plays on the Bethlehem label. This one, um, I definitely can get get you going cheap on this one if you're interested. It's definitely a low-grade copy in the good plus VG minus range. Um, but if you're interested, let me know also on the Discogs page. Um, the next two or two that I've had for quite some time, this one honestly um, is very cheap. Uh, it's a very rare mono promo of Hal Acoustic. Uh, I'm willing to let this go really cheap because I bought it thinking it was going to be in better shape and it wasn't. And um, so look on Discogs for that or just message me. A very, very rare promo. They did not make a lot of these at all. Um, the last one is one that's kind of a really special piece. So I've kind of been holding out. I've had some offers, um, but I am holding out a little on this one. It's Amos Lee, and it's classic records, but it's on the Clarity vinyl. Very hard record to find. Um, very, very uncommon record. Uh, classic did just a few of those Clarities towards the tail end, so if you're interested, let me know on that one. Now, all the rest of these are really big, heavy hitters. All are still sealed. Almost all of them are numbered except for one of them, uh, except for a few. Um, and they're all audiophile analog production stuff. So the first one is 45 RPM Acoustatec, Hank Mobley dipping. Um, this one is numbered, uh, brand new, still sealed. 
Then I have Jackie McLean New Soil, also Acoustatech, also sealed, also numbered. Um, also 40. Now these are all 45 RPMs of those. Uh, the next one is Jackie McLean Lights Out. This is part of that Prestige 200 gram series. Again, still sealed, um, not numbered, but sealed. Then I have Jackie McLean 456. Again, part of that 200 gram, very limited run Prestige ones, um, still sealed not numbered on that one. The next one is going to be AT's The Light, uh, 45 RPM Acoustatech. This one is numbered, um, still sealed. Every single one of the rest of these records are all still sealed. Um, Horace Parlin, Moving and Grooving, 45 RPM Acoustatech, Analog Productions, numbered. Lou Donaldson, the time is right. Again, Acoustatech, 45 RPM, sealed, numbered. Next one is not numbered. Um, still sealed, Nora Jones, come away with me. I ended up actually getting a second copy of this. Um, so still sealed, uh, Analog Productions. Helen Mural, Analog Productions, still sealed. And then the final one is Freddie Hubbard, Hubcap, Acoustatech, 45 RPM, numbered, sealed. If you're interested, let me know about any of them. Uh, email me in the bassclef at yahoo.com, discogs in the bassclef. Shoot me a comment here. Um, just let me know if you have any interest. Thanks so much for watching.